Christophe Claret, a virtuoso watchmaker. Admired for his movements of great complication, he has so far supplied movements to some 20 prestigious brands out of his factory. In 2009, Christophe Claret added a new string to his bow by creating his own brand, of which the first watch is the now famous Dualto. It features a planetary single button chronograph system with striking work and tourbillon. Since then, it is here on the route of the Golden Sun that some of the most beautiful and complicated watches in Switzerland are designed and produced in their entirety. The collection follows several themes. Extreme watches, so-called after their experimental time research engineering mechanism, such as the Extreme One, the first watch with a tourbillon with magnetic display. Striking work watches, a Claret's signature feature to which he owes his international reputation, such as the Soprano with a minute repeating tourbillon of the Westminster type. The collection of watches with automats inspired by games of chance, such as the Blackjack and the Baccarat. The Neuchâtel Mountains, where Christophe Claret established his factory, are home to the blossoming of an uninterrupted dream, to apply state-of-the-art technology to the long tradition of Swiss watchmaking. The manor of the Golden Sun in the Locke is where the brand has taken shape, in a region steeped in art and history. Since 1989, we have specialized in the conception and production of movements with innovative complications. To this end, we adapt, or sometimes invent, the machines we need to achieve our quality standards. Christophe Claret is an inventor who draws the first drafts himself and furnishes the initial impetus for each project. He passes the drafts to his technical team, who will find the means to implement his ideas. Christophe Claret's factory covers practically all phases of the creation of a new watch. The machines are specifically programmed for each new project. They will sculpt the raw material and give it the exact form as defined. The robot itself collects the tools needed to work the raw materials. Each operation is conceived with great care, precision being the cornerstone. The machines proceed to cut and adjust the tiniest pieces, checking them in cases where manual intervention is impossible. This level of performance opens new possibilities for the creation of complications formerly too difficult to accomplish. High precision components created by the machines then pass through numerous stages of finishing, thermal treatment, galvanization, decoration, polishing, and chamfering. The manipulation of tiny pieces nearly invisible to the naked eye can only be accomplished by the uniquely human intervention so necessary to fine watchmaking. About a hundred people are currently employed at Christophe Claret's company. They represent the over 15 different professions needed to conceive an exceptional timepiece. The components are verified against the specs before being moved to stock. In the well-named Room of Treasure, two million components of various forms often of precious metals, are strictly guarded. The technical manager is responsible for the fine-tuning of the most complex calibers, as well as for overseeing the work of all the watchmakers. Before being placed in the dial, some pieces require flame treatment in order to bring out the blue of the steel there follow a series of verifications using bifocals and tests for waterproofing. The movements are tested for a period of one to four weeks to check all functions. 
Before delivery, Christophe Claret personally checks each timepiece. In watchmaking, everything's been done and everything is still yet to do. 